hello friends welcome once again to the channel IT simplified in today's video Nashua I'm here to show you how to change the access level of your storage account from hot tier to archival so let's get started so we'll create a storage account give the name Pick your desired location of deployment. We'll pick journal purpose version 2. And for replication, I will just keep it uh, LRS. And as you can see under the access tier, I only have the option of choosing between hot or cool. And by default, it is hot. There is no archival tier. But we'll come to this. So let me just create this and click on the create button. The deployment was successful. Let me just go inside the storage account and create a blob container. I'll name it container one. Click on OK. And in order to uh, prove this, what I'm going to do is I will upload a small file that I have on my local machine now the reason we have to do this way is because you cannot uh, specify the access tier level of archival at the storage account level it has to be done at the blob level so right now as you can see we have taken the default which is hot tier so I will expand these three dots, go to the blob properties. And here if you scroll down, you can see the access tier. I can move it to archival. Pick this and click on the save button. And now if I go back, you can see the access tier has been changed to archival tier. I hope this you found this video on Azure Blob Storage from hot tier to archival tier useful. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.